Welcome back, Pure Structure Traders, for another market analysis for the London session. Today is March 11, 2021, here in Hawaii, and will be March 12, 2021, in London. Today, we'll be going over S&P 500 and also gold, some of the levels we're looking for to play off during the London session and potentially moving into the U.S. session. So let's go ahead and start here with S&P 500. We did have a very nice climb to the upside. Uh, we did pull closer to about those 3960s and uh, we did pull down from there into a main level of right around 3250. Nice little bit of a double bottom sitting right here at this area here. You can see and then we're trying to pull back up. Still strongly bullish so we want to pay attention to that. Uh, this may potentially try to drift down into these 3819s and then below that. Uh, I'm sorry, 39.19 and then below that 39.10 and 39.00. But we'll watch out to see what happens. Potentially, we could look for the market to either come into these 54.50s to show up as some resistance. Uh, if it doesn't get through that level, that's going to be a good opportunity for us to look for maybe a nice double top and then a pull down. Once we get underneath these 32.50s, though, do want to see the market try to drift a little bit lower, retest, and then come into that 39.19. And then 39.10 underneath that. Uh, now, if you're looking for that bullish move, again, you're looking for maybe right here at these 39, 32.50s for a continuation or move up, or you're looking to break this level, come back, retest it, and then continue to move higher from there. So we'll see what S&P gives us. Let's take a look at a smaller chart here to get an idea of what's going on in the smaller picture here. So you can see nice little bit of a double bottom that took place right there good opportunity didn't get that but got a nice short off of the area didn't come all the way back up to the area i would have liked it to right around 47 but i was looking right around 46 after we rejected that price and then that pull down back to the actual support that was a good opportunity of trade didn't get all the way down through that level so we are bouncing we may consolidate we did have a nice movement we may consolidate right between these two areas here before it makes a move up or down again you want to keep in mind the trend is bullish so you can look for some trend trades which is off the supports or you can try to look so for some reversal trades which is the resistance levels uh, let's take a look at gold here real quickly give you guys some levels on that gold we did move up and then we started to move back down you can see we're under some levels of prior support reacting as resistance uh, right up underneath these 1725.5s and you can see what happened here market dipped a little bit under want to see it reject this price action right here or this price 1718.3 if it fails to get through look for that downside into the 12.1s and then 1706.3 and 1701 1701.4 we do got some levels underneath but we're gonna have to let gold move around a little bit and then get to that area of support if we continue lower so it's going to look something like this continue to reject and fall back down uh, for more of a push lower so you can look for opportunities to continue to sell that rip on the pullbacks but if we get back above these 1725s you may see this market try to round back out and pull back to the upside from there so we'll look out for that let's take a look at a smaller picture here on gold gold again trying to pull up into this level do want to see it reject nicely off of that 1718.3 and then once we can't get through that area it's going to be a good opportunity for me to look for a downside move from there so i am anticipating that it's my first level of trade if we do get above that i will look for the actual support on top and then a continuation up from there so that is it for s p 500 and also for gold Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. If you guys did, please go ahead and smash that like button. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, please go ahead and subscribe. If you guys are, thank you very much for watching and liking these videos. If you have any questions, feel free to comment here on YouTube. We will get back to you guys. Other than that, guys, you guys take care. Have a great night.